Hey, good morning. This is Anthony from 39 Below, a channel dedicated to picking, hustling, finding items priced at $39 and below, only to be sold at a higher dollar amount. Here to teach you, educate you, and show you the little tricks of the trade that we have done here at 39 Below on eBay, Etsy, Amazon, other e-commerce sites, and all that kind of stuff. I'm going to do a quick video here, talk as fast as I can before I head out. Uh, it's going to be about the emails that I've been getting. I've got inundated with a lot of them about the same kind of questions. Um, and a lot of it is in the book, the book, the book, the book. It's a quick read. It's like a peanut, man. It'll fill you really quick, and it's got great data in it. Get my book. I'm going to put the links below. You can, if you want the hard copy, um, it's only like 90 pages. If you want the hard copy, it's on Amazon. Uh, if you want an ebook, I just ran a 99-cent sale. Uh, so obviously, you're not checking. You could have picked it up. Is the, the value, the amount of money you're going to make by reading this is going to far out exceed the cost of it. I believe it's on sale right now for $4.99. And I'll have the link below. Pick it up. Get it. Read it. Has all these questions will be answered for you in here, but I'm gonna get back to the question that I'm getting a lot, and obviously you're not following the trifecta for success, which is in here. I talk about there's videos on that, the four P's um, to list: um, picking, preparing, photo, and profit, and, and and a couple of other things. Page if you do have the book, go to page 44, read the trifecta of success. The members, the members to our site, you get this free. You got this free. Read it. I don't want to see a question that's right in here. Because all I want to do is give you a page number. Go to page 43. Because, you know, I, I put a lot of time in, into this. It's a legit book. It's got an ISBN number <laughs> and everything. So, um, you know, I'm pulling out the last strand of hair I have left on my head. But uh, just think about that. But dig into it. If you're a member to our lead site, dig into it. The book's free. You get every book from here on out. Working on two other ones that are going to be out probably by the summer. And... Um, well, probably one by the spring and the other by the, by the summer, but uh, you get these free, so indulge in it. Uh, all right, the question I have is uh, how to list and what I should put in the heading, and why am I not getting enough views? Why am I not getting enough hits? Uh, why is my click through rate? Think about this. eBay is an e-commerce site. There's algorithms that are put in place. There's keywords that are searched. Okay, um, there's not a... A Wizard of Oz behind the eBay door is sitting and saying, okay, well, just because you put in this for your heading, we're going to give it to this buyer. These buyers are simple-minded, okay? When you list an item, for instance, this jacket, Armani Men's 42R, okay? That's how I would search. I'm either on, I'm either on the go, I'm on my phone, okay? I'm, I'm sitting in my car, I'm at a stoplight, I'm at my office, I'm shopping. Most of the time I'm out shopping, um, I go hit... A, you know, a store and I'm looking for something, I'm checking eBay. I'm, buy, I'm probably buying from the people who are watching, okay, because I'm going to see if I can get it cheaper. Same product, maybe not the best quality or the newest quality of pre-owned, but still, if I'm buying from someone who wants this and I know you're taking pride in, in your in your four, you know, your four P's, your picking, your preparation, your photo, and of course, profit. So I trust that I can get that product. So people are out there doing the same thing as me. They want it rapid. They want that listing rapid. Put the keywords of what buyers are searching for. Think differently. Okay? Think differently. Think like the buyer. Is eBay going forward? I put that because it's, it's a new mindset. There is a shift. It's a pair, it's it's definitely a paradigm shift to how sellers are gonna transact and start to prepare their products and how they're gonna list their products going forward. I think it's gonna be a major shift in the next couple of years. Um the shift is going to hit hard. People got to have to understand that you have to be rapid. Secondly, you have to be exacting. Meaning you have to be exact. What, what keywords are these people searching for? You got to be exacting. Because if someone puts in, again, if I put in Armani uh, Men's 42R tan colored blazer, that's very exacting. If my key, my keywords match that, of course, it's going to go whoop. My item's going to be popped up to that top. So you want to be exact and you want to really study those words. And again, I preach niche. If your niche is men's clothing, you specialize in blazers and polo shirts and button downs, your keywords are going to become exacting. You're going to know exactly what to use. But if you're selling a whole ton of different stuff, you're never going to become a master at that one product. Uh, second thing is layman's terms. Um, and, and, I, and I did a video on this NWT. Uh, new with tags, but I mean, there's tons of them out there. Um, a simpleton buyer, someone again who's on who's on the go. I'm in my car. I'm not. Just, I'm not going to put in WNT. 
I, you know, I might put in towards the end, uh, you know, Armani men's 42R blazer new. I might put new, but, you know, I mean, I'm going to pretty much use the word. I don't know. There are some sophisticated buyers. And again, I, I, I've gotten some comments of people saying, well, I'm a buyer. Well, you're also a seller. You're also in there. You're doing it every day. You understand that, that there is a language. Um, cops know it. Military people know it. There's a language that is spoken, but the outside world. So when someone calls calls 911, they don't say, 10-4, uh, can I have a... Uh, Signal twenty nine sent to my you know they don't they don't use those terms as cops use. It's I'm getting robbed. Please send please send someone over now. Okay, so layman's terms is very important. Of course, I got notes right here. Uh, and the last thing that I'm going to say is the more hassle that you put, the more frustrated that buyer is definitely gonna is definitely gonna be getting. To me, that is a selling barrier. You want your your buyer to just just to feel that it's easy. It flows. The terms. That are being used, the descriptions that are being used, um, the photos that are up is easy for them. Just like going to a store, they browse a store, they look at the tag, they flip it over, the person comes over and greets them, they say hi, it's very easy. They walk out, they buy, they come back, they you know make it as easy as you can. So anyway, that's my little rant for today. I'm out the door. Actually, I got one more video that I'm going to do, and then I'm going to leave. But uh, hope this helps, and uh, the links will be below. Snag your copy if you can't afford it. Or if you don't value it, if you don't think five bucks is going to make you, that this book is not going to make you more than five bucks, send me an email, anthony39below at gmail.com. I'll send you a free copy. But with that, you're going to promise me that you're going to buy my next book because the effort I'm putting in, you know, I think it's worth it. So, all right, uh, take care, and I'll see you on the flip side.